Things start to slow down a little bit here on the Sun Coast in August. But there's still plenty of fun to be had. ABC 7's Linda Carson gives us some ideas in Sun Coast scene. Let these kids entertain you. Suncoast kids from 7 to 15 have spent the summer learning how to stage a musical at the Player Center. Now they're showing off what they've learned with Madagascar Jr. Madagascar Jr. is just a fun musical romp. It is based off of the animated movie. It's the story of Alex the Lion, Marty the Zebra, and all of their friends. And they uh, have a wonderful life in the New York City in the Central Park Zoo. And... Um, through a crazy series of events, find themselves in Madagascar. You've got one chance only to see Madagascar Jr. here at the Players Center, August the 4th at 7 p.m. So relax, be cool, get on down here. Relax, be cool, and the Urbanite, Sarasota's exciting, thought-provoking black box theater, rolls out a brand new cutting edge play this week. Pilgrims is set on a spaceship on the way to colonize a newly discovered planet. A soldier and a girl find themselves quarantined together in the same cabin. It's really about two people trying to connect and trying to deal with whatever horrible things have happened to them in their lives. So um, I think it's really a hopeful story in the sense of like you can start over again, um, at least from the girl's perspective, like recreate a new life somewhere else, completely reinvent yourself and have more agency in the way you live your life. Pilgrims opens at the Urbanite Theater August 3rd and it runs through September 10th. It's a play that you will think about and talk about for a long time to come. And give your wallet a break. Admission is free to Music on Main Friday night from 6 to 9 in Lakewood Ranch. The Click Band will be live playing great classical rock and roll music. Fun for the whole family. And the 45th annual dance sport competition is at the Ritz right now. Thursday and Friday night, see some of the latest steps in ballroom performed by some of the best dancers in the world. We have at least four or five world champions here competing in each other in different categories. And during the day, professional dancers team up with amateurs for the Pro Am competition. They get scholarships, they can earn money and scholarships and trophies, and it's prestigious. And it all adds up to another entertaining weekend here on the Suncoast. For Suncoast Scene, Linda Carson, ABC7, your Suncoast News.